Facebook has decided apparently the Declaration of Independence is hate speech. No, we're not joking about that. Facebook apologizes for censoring the Declaration of Independence as hate speech. Facebook has apologized to a Texas newspaper after flagging a post containing text from the Declaration of Independence as hate speech. A Breitbart News reported on Wednesday, Facebook removed an expert from the U.S. Declaration of Independence claiming the text violated the social network's policy on hate speech. The Liberty Count Vindicator had been uploading the Declaration of Independence in parts to their Facebook page, only the, the tenth part to be removed by social media network. Following the portion of text, sorry, the following portion of text was exercised by Facebook as constituting hate speech. So the part they removed is he has advocated government here by declaring us out of his protection and waging war against us. He has plummeted our seas, ravaged our coast, burnt our towns and destroyed our lives of our people. Here is the time transporting large armies of foreign mercenaries to compel the works of death, desolation and tyranny already began with the circumstances of cruelty and perfection. Perfetti? Perfetti? I don't know that word. Uh, scandally paralyzed in the most barrageous age and totally unworth the head of the civilized nation. He has constrained our fellow citizens, taken captive on the high seas to bear arms against their country, to become the executioner of their friends and brethren or follow fallen themselves by their hands. He has exercised domestic insurrections among us and endeavoured to bring on the inabilities of our fort frontiers and merciless inland, sorry, and merciless in Indian savages, who known rule of warfare is an indistinguished destruction of all ages, sexes, and conditions. And I apologise to any Americans that have got offended by me butchering that. It's nine o'clock in the morning. I'm tired. Uh, case I think I identified the hate speech part. Yeah. <clears throat> it's when it said uh, the, the, Indian the Indians savages. are savages. Yeah. I yeah, was that's the say, bit that flagged it, I think. Yeah, I was going to say, actually, at the end of this, that Indian savages, I think, is what triggered it. But let's keep going. Casey Sunnett, managing editor of the Liberty Count Vindicator, suspects the term Indian savages, which is what we just said, might have triggered <laughs> Facebook's filtering program. He said the censorship was an automatic action. Sinan wrote, This is frustrating, but your editor is historian. And to enjoy the study of history, a person must love irony. It's a very great irony that the words of Thomas Jefferson should now be censored in America. Okay. Um, I, I'm going to surprise you guys a little bit on this. Um... So, obviously, guys, we are joined once again in the Discord by Satellite of Discontent, Officer Slaps, Grandpa Spud, who still cannot talk, and Bobo. Um, I'm going to say I understand why it was caught by the automatic bot. I don't well, know. Well, yeah, I think, I think we understand, but yeah. maybe, yeah. It's just, this is the problem with censorship, in general. Yeah. Like, obviously, then this is... Oh, well, I was going to say, this is more of a problem with AI, to be honest, because they don't understand context. Um, but, yeah, the, the, the AI obviously doesn't understand that this is the... You know, this is the major Declaration of Independence. This is the, the major article of US that... Yeah, like... It's the reason that shit is legal in the first place. Yeah, like... It, hang on, so for the Australians and everything in the group, Declaration of Independence, that is what basically goes through and decorates the US as independent from the UK, right? Hence the Declaration of Independence. Yeah, it was yeah. a letter we yeah. sent to King George. Yep. Yeah. Does it have the, the uh, free speech and First and Second Amendments in that? Or is that something else? No, the Bill of Rights. That's the That's Constitution. The... Alright, okay, so it's not that. Um, so, yeah, look, I understand why it was caught. I understand why the bot caught it. 
Um, I think, yeah, at the end of the day, I don't agree with it, but I understand it. And, yeah, you know, the, yeah, I just, can we not censor people's speech? That would be great, you know, just Facebook, just stop now while you're behind, so to speak, I suppose. I don't know, guys, what are your thoughts on this? Do you, do you understand? Do you, do you agree with it? Do you think it's a lot of well, crap? Honestly... Um, since this is Facebook censoring people, I almost hope that they get even worse with their censorship and that they drive even more people away because people fucking start hating Facebook. Well, people already do. They're garbage. Yeah, yeah every, a lot of fucking people do, but there's still a lot of people on Facebook. And, you know, if they continue to just become more draconian and a shittier platform, that's just going to drive people away even faster. True. The MySpace syndrome. Yeah, well, this is the thing. Okay, so say people leave Facebook. Um, and I think it was the, the Cranbridge Atletica scandal that sort of really sealed Facebook's PR disaster for them. Um, but I, I was going to say, just them censoring everything, just shutting down freedom of speech, banning people left and right. It, you know, look, I, I'm not surprised but the thing is, is that is there anywhere else to go that normies are like? Obviously, we have minds and stuff, but we don't, we don't really. The normies don't really have anything else that they know of, do they? Like, how many people just use Facebook because it's Facebook and they don't have anywhere else to go? A lot Shit, of I use boomers. My, my Facebook is just like a meme repository, pretty much. You still have your account? How does that work? <laughs> I don't have any fucking personal information on there, so I'd probably say it pretty nice. No, but I was going to say, uh, just with memes, I thought they would have banned you for the memes and stuff. I mean, just got to create enough, like, secret groups. They can't find you. Sure. Got some shit that they definitely would not approve of and would get deleted immediately if they found it. But I it's mean, a closed group, yeah. They have to find it. And what about you, Seth? What are your thoughts on this? I mean, I don't have Facebook anymore because <clears throat> I posted a meme, which I won't describe. Mm. And, uh, yeah, it got me uh, a 30 day and I just simply just went, okay, I'm untagging myself from everything and deleting my account. I was done. Mm. And yeah, post it on the discord, please. <laughs> sure. Sure. I will. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, the funny thing too, is that I'm actually a bit pessimistic, which your audience might sort of already have picked up on in the past mm. that I think that. The fact that this happened has is bringing attention to the words, right? Mm. And it wouldn't surprise me by you know by in a few days that we're going to have you know lefties just running around going, "Oh my god, this is in the Declaration of Independence! Oh my god, how racist!" And it's just going to be yeah. awful. Yeah. yeah. So look, like I say, I apologize anyone again that the fact if I got any of those words wrong, I know it's a kind of a a sacred document. Um, yeah, yeah. It's I've been up for like eighteen hours straight at the moment, so it's I'm not doing too well. Um, but yeah, uh, look, uh, yeah, I I understand why the AI bot has obviously gone through and censored it. Um, I don't agree with it. I'd I'd rather delete the AI bot and you know have Facebook open and free platform, but. I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Like, got even Gab, you know, we're starting to see censorship on Gab. He tried to do a stream the other day, and, you know, what, two, after two temps, it, it wouldn't stream. Um, that in itself, I want to hit yeah. up Andrew about and say, you know, like, what the actual hell, hell is going on about this, but, yeah. I mean, yeah. on what Satellite was saying, about, like, lefties going out and fucking, like, thought policing. I mean, even in America, like, even leftists wouldn't only handle that shit to a certain degree. Like, mm. you go up and tell someone what they can say and what they can't say. Like, even the most hardcore leftist is going to be like, uh, no, fuck you, get out of my face. Sure. What are you going to say, Seth? Oh, yeah, no. Actually, I was going to say that. Okay, cool. All right. Um... Because we've seen it before. Where We have seen it before where... Uh... The left also cries censorship when they get censored by the AI bot. 
Oh yeah, the, you just go look at the girls that were banned from Facebook because they went on a men hating spree, and then cried about being censored on Facebook, getting banned, getting Facebook jail on Facebook. Well, like yeah, but when the when the when the conservatives got jail on Facebook for saying mean stuff, you celebrated it. But now the shoot is on the other foot. You know, you you're crying, you know, bloody murder, so to speak. But anyway. But guys, let me know your thoughts are in the comment section below. Do you understand why the AI bot censored it? Do you think this is right? Do you think this is wrong? Would you want to find another platform besides Facebook? If you know one, let me know in the comment section below. Um, but guys, yeah, apart from that, let us know what your thoughts are in that comment section. If this video has been helpful, please smack a like. If you're new to the channel, welcome and subscribe. Apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next demonetized video from YouTube. Have a great day. And enjoy.